What's up, my friends and the viewers of the tube? Today we're gonna to be doing a update with Drip because we love to talk about Drip and what they're doing, what they're not doing, and all everything in between. As you can see, we are now sitting at 99% from the all-time high. Uh, so anyone who bought pretty much from $55 to $55 is never gonna make their money back. Um, so that's pretty sad uh, to say the least. But, you know, math just shows, you can watch some of my other videos that literally shows that it's impossible to make your money back if you invested in any of these times without buying a falling knife. But um, the, the, I think it's funny that with this project, so many people are saying that oh it's gonna pump to you know ten dollars or twenty dollars it's so it's so easy to do that but there are a few major things that are different between the last bull run and um the never bull run that is going to happen with um with drip uh i know they say that you know everything happens in cycles but that's obviously a lie because not everything happens in cycles. Not every crypto project that was here in 2017 uh, is still here today. Um, the same projects that started, you know, many many years ago, uh, are some of most of them are not here today. And so the cycles are new projects that come out uh, during a bull run, and when the next bull happen, bull run happens or a halving happens. Most of those projects never uh, get up steam. Reason being is they've lost so much in value that the community has broken up. Um, there's just not as much, uh, there's new shiny things that people are getting into. And one of the major things is there was a million drip uh, in this first bull run. Now there's uh, almost 18 million. So 18 times more tokens within circulation to overcome with uh, this project. So to say that things go in cycles and that uh, just wait till the next bull run and drip will hit all time highs again is delusional. I think that a lot of people that are in this project are suffering from sunk cost fallacy, uh, which is the phenomenon for those that don't know that where a person uh, does not want to abandon a particular project because they've invested so heavily in it and they, they have to believe. And even though leaving the project and investing somewhere else would be more beneficial. And to kind of sum this up, I found this guy who just recently posted, I think uh, right here, uh, 12 hours ago, how he's bullish because he got a maxed wallet. And I think that's very funny because uh, he invested $300 uh, over the weekend on January 25th. And if we look back at January 25th, it was, I think, uh, rough, roughly about 50 cents. And now it's down uh, to 28 cents. So uh, that $300 investment is now worth $150. And so you have a lot of these people that got in to this project uh, even when it looks like it's been flat, that have still lost money. I mean, if we look right here, the 25th, uh, 52 cents, 51 cent, uh, and now it's at 28 cents, and it has gone lower. I mean, if you think about it, there has been pumps that are much greater that have happened in the last couple months. I mean, this going from $4.79 to $10, almost 100% gain, um, from 27 cents to 60 cents is another like 100% gain. But now everyone's getting very excited about a 25% pump with DDD, which is gonna fail. I mean, all of uh, Four Shark, Forex Shark, whatever the name is, uh, has failed. I mean, you look at Pinky Plankos, never launched. On ramp and off ramp, never launched. Um, what else? Some scratchies never launched. Animal farm with dogs and pigs, failure. Uh, I mean, I think dogs 
Let's see what dogs are. And I, I warned you guys about um, that dogs was gonna be hitting all time lows, like animal farm dogs. And we can just look at that awesomeness. Uh, literally, if you invested at the very start of this, you would be down 92% on your money with no chance of recovering whatsoever. Uh, even Quick Shoes, who said June 9th, said that all these projects are gonna fail. And we can just look at, let's look at Animal Farm Pigs. Big dump today. It looks like um, if we can go to the all time. Um, so it, from 26, yeah, it's just hitting all time lows every single every single day pretty much. Uh, if you would have invested at 185, I think they had also uh, the, like a, a tax if you bought and you didn't hold for a certain time. So pretty much just locking people out of their money so that the team, which is Forex Shark, could dump on all of you guys. I think he also minted a bunch of tokens that he stole money from you guys, so congratulations on that. And way to support a criminal. So I definitely good job on that, everyone that invested in this uh, this project. But um, yeah, I think I um, for those that um, don't understand math or supply and demand or just basic economics, I would highly recommend just uh, going through my actual YouTube and learning how crypto works. Um, I've been pretty much spot on with all my investments. Um, there was a few when I, at the very beginning of my journey, that uh, I got effed on with um, algorithmic, algorithmic stable coins. Uh, I think Titan was one, and then Luna I lost a lot. Uh, but other than that, I've been very profitable with um, my crypto. And so when I look at a project like this, I get in and I get out quickly. Um, obviously some of these like dApps like this, you have to kind of just keep hoping that they don't rug. But um, I mean, I think with Drip in general, I think it's under now a million in, uh, let's see here, Drip Dex, Drip Dex. I believe it's under a million in liquidity. So it just keeps dropping. Um, it is at 999,000 in pooled BUSD. So now it's under a million. I think it was up to $10 million at one point, uh, maybe even higher. I think I actually did a video to, uh, that said it was the animal farm or drip was the a $25 million scam. Um, and I've been right all along. Let's see if I have that video where I can be like, man, you guys just got F'd in the A. So let me just pull that up. Um, I can't find it right now, but feel free to check my videos. I've been right 100% on Drip. Um, so yeah. Uh, drip won't last, Animal Farm won't last. That was September 1st. Animal Farm and Drip, um, July 7th. So I've definitely been reporting on these projects for quite a while and why you should never invest in them, but at least with Drip and a few others. And I've been right 100% of the time. So um, that's about it, guys. Hope you learned some things. Remember to subscribe so you can actually win instead of um, lose every single day with Drip. And that's about it. Peace.